Working as a server, one of the worst tips I ever received was $2 on a $198 bill. The older gentleman handed me $200 bills with a wink and said, keep the change like he was doing me some kind of favor. Based on my experience as a server, <clears throat> you might think that I'm in favor of mandatory tipping, but I am not. Tipping should always be a choice, but we should always choose to tip. Tips can constitute over 60% of servers' total earning, according to, article, to an article copyrighted in 2019 on tableagent.com. My, my beliefs on tipping are based on my personal experience as a server and a bartender for over seven years and the research that I have done to back up my point of view. I believe we should always choose to tip because servers get less than minimum wage and are dependent on the tips that they receive. And if we made tips mandatory or abolished tipping altogether, I believe that the experience in the restaurant would be less enjoyable. I'd like to start by debunking theories, basically, that I have heard or people have said to me directly. Um, I've had lots of people tell me they just don't believe in tipping. Not tipping your server doesn't change the American tipping system. It doesn't change that we are still expecting tips. It just ruins that server's day. If you really want to make a change, you should contact your law, contact your lawmakers or only attend restaurants where they don't rely on tipping and they pay their servers a decent wage. <clears throat> In 2013, Meg uh, Favreau at US News said, some restaurants that you go to, your server doesn't actually receive the, the full tip that you give based on their experience. Some people think it's just a couple dollars, it won't be missed. But based on tip sharing that happens in restaurants uh, where you tip your server and then they, at the end of the night, based on their sales, not the tips they receive, they have to give every front of house staff member a portion of their sales. Whether it be 1% or 2%, it does add up at the end of the night. I have tipped out over $40 on some nights, which is a lot of money considering that I worked really hard for all of that. Another one I've heard is if you don't like not getting tips, why don't you just get a real job? Well, serving is a real job. We all pay taxes on the money that we receive every, every dollar that we earn. There's many reasons working at a restaurant is worth it um, and why people actually go there searching for a job. The restaurant business is worth approximately $709 billion in 2019, according to a team at Jobletics. Basically, working at a restaurant provides you customer service skills. It is a flexible schedule around your family, school, other jobs, and that's why people really enjoy working there. Tipping is normal in the, U in the US, and making tipping mandatory or abolishing tipping would allow servers to put forth less effort in, ser in the services that they provide. One of the big reasons that I think tipping should not be mandatory is that it would decrease the incentive to work hard at your job. Uh, Paul Donovan with Newsweek said in 2016, if we abolish the tip, we take away the service. I fully believe that. I think that if you, if you are getting the same wage every hour, no matter what work you do, I think servers would try a lot less that just to make your service, make your experience at a restaurant any better, like why, what would encourage them to work harder if they're not getting a tip at the end? Tips are normally reflective of service. It's basically an instant review of how you treated your guests while they were there. And if we got rid of that, how would we know what, how would we, how would we know what we needed to improve? I also think that it would impact us, impact servers to believe that they don't need a busy restaurant. If they're making $10 an hour, no matter if they have one table or six, why would they want to have six tables at once? Not only will staff be less focused on guest service, but there are other factors that will affect the overall experience as well. Um, I think that if we raise the minimum wage for servers, it's going to raise the prices at restaurants. Uh, the higher labor costs with the increased minimum wage um, it's going to cause uh, managers to cut their staff, which is going to overwork their staff, which then are going, the staff that is there is not going to be as eager to please. Higher menu prices will have to occur if we raise the minimum wage just to make any profit at a restaurant. 
2016, an article at Restaurant Hospitality by Bob Crummer quoted a tipping expert, uh, Michael Lynn, as saying, replacing tipping with service charges or higher menu prices would allow restaurants to reduce the total payments to servers. Basically saying that we're gonna work harder for less money in the end. I think that if we abolish tipping or made tipping mandatory, uh, the customers at the restaurant would have a sense of loss of control. Uh, basically, we like being able to choose and taking that away is gonna make the experience less enjoyable. Tipping improves satisfaction. Uh, Ann Steich, a contributing writer at Chicago Business Journal stated in 2018 that taking tipping away can alienate diners and lead to negative reviews and negatively impact revenue. Serving is a real job and it's a good job. I believe that uh, tipping is at the diner's discretion, but we should always choose to tip. An article published in 2009 by wiserwaitress.com says, although diners are free to leave nothing at all and the tip system is voluntary, leaving a tip has become an integral part of the US dining culture. I think basically anytime you go to a restaurant in the United States, it's well known that you're supposed to tip and I think that that's probably not gonna change anytime soon. I think tipping increases the work ethic of the staff at a restaurant. It also improves the customer service skills because they have to work harder, be nicer, treat people with more respect. And all of this adds up to the best experience for the diner. Remember, in the future, I hope that you remember that the tip you give your server rewards for a job well done, it motivates them to work harder, and it helps ensure that the whole restaurant is gonna work together as a team. I can't pay my bills with no tips or 0.01% tip. I do love my job, but it would be more enjoyable if everyone who came to the restaurant understood that a tip, while optional, should always be given in response to the services that they receive.